And we're back here on Civic Center Wrestling. Glad to be back here with you. Also, we have, uh, again, three title matches and a steel cage match on this card. And we're going to head back to the action momentarily as you see there, Pistol Pez Wally will take on the man from East Germany, Baron Von Raschke, along with his manager, number one, Paul Jones. Of course, Baron Von Raschke, now one-third of the World Six-Man Tag Team Championship team, uh, along with Ivan and Nikita Koloff. As you know, recently there was uh, an injury to Crusher Khrushchev. Uh, Ivan Koloff, along with the blessing of Paul Jones, selected Baron Von Raschke to be their, their partner in the Six-Man Tag Team Championship uh, team. As we head right to the action here, as they're in the ring, ready to go, and Baron goes right after Pistol Pez Watley. Paul Jones looking very dapper out there in that zoot suit, if you will. Baron Von Raschke, of course, the toll holder of the uh, NWA World Tag Team Championship on numerous occasions, along with the guy who's at ringside with him, Paul Jones, as a matter of fact. Pistol Pez Watley now turning up the burner here. The man from UTC Chattanooga, and there's that drop salt of his. At least that's what I call it. That drop kick is absolutely impressive, and he does it again. Extremely athletic is this graduate of the University of Tad Tennessee at Chattanooga. Once again, Pez nails him in the corner with that running elbow. Watley now unceremoniously brings the Baron out toward the center of the ring. But it is the Baron who strikes back. And a neck breaker well executed. Now, Baron Von Raschke now controlling the, the head and then controlling the body of Pistol Pez Watley with that chin lock. Baron Von Raschke heading over to the corner and removing the top turnbuckle pad for some strange reason. I don't know why, but uh, Paul Jones also out there looking a little unscrupulous, and Pez Watley sees this and nails Jones. Barron goes outside the ring, comes back in. Referee's getting in the way. Paul Jones threw the chair in the ring. Baron Von Raschke removed the top turnbuckle, and you see the effect of it as Watley went extremely hard into that turnbuckle. When that pad's removed, it's bad enough when you hit it back first, but when you remove the turnbuckle, that's even more painful for what I understand. Pez fighting back. The pistol man. Those right hands right at the gut of Baron Von Raschke, but it was blocked. And a clubbing blow to the back of the head. Stomps to the arm. Von Raschke now with a clubbing blow and, and into a sleeper hold. Baron Von Raschke trying to end this one quick. How much longer Pez is going to be able to hold out here, but he drops straight south and... Bit of a modified jawbreaker there. Still a little out. He wasn't really able to get that offensive maneuver off, but there's a DDT on Baron Von Raschke. Dropped him face first. I don't know exactly what Pez was going for there, but Baron had it scouted. Irish whip in. And a high back body drop by the pistol man. Von Raschke had that scouted, and what are we going to see here? A reversal, it looked like. And Paul Jones up on the apron. He's distracting Pistol Pez Wadley, and, well, there's, there you go right there. That's what happens when that man outside the ring gets involved. Oh, and he clotheslines him over the top rope. This might well be it. No, a kick out. Pistol Pez comes out. I mentioned that's what happens when you get a guy like Paul Jones out there unscrupulous manager that he is causing a distraction distraction for his man Pez had that scout at a clothesline actually I think he got him with the forearm that time there's that drop salt of his Pez Watley now going to the lower body now Pez Watley now really trying to get some put some offensive maneuvers together here and get the advantage and 
try to get the victory here over the veteran Baron Von Raschke as now he stomps right to the solar plexus. Pez very smartly distancing himself from the Baron who well is going to come right out after him as you see we are on prism here exclusively here with Civic Center Wrestling glad to have you with us and he's raking away at the face of ba uh, excuse me of of a pistol Pez Wiley and now he's going right to the face referee is counting he's up to three Oh, into the ring apron Referee is counting. Of course, you know, you never know with Paul Jones. He'd be satisfied if his guy got a count out victory. I don't know. I think Pez might be a little addle out here. He's taking a lot of punishment now. He just went head first right into the security railing here at ringside. Oh, and he reverses it. He sends the Baron into the steel steps. Pez Watley right out after. Baron Von Raschke sends the big man. Well, I thought he was going to send him back in the ring. Went face first off the apron. Again, I want to mention the title matches we have for you tonight. National Heavyweight Championship to be decided as the American Dream Dusty Rhodes with Baby Doll in his corner will defend against Tully Blanchard along with James J. Dillon. That will be coming up later tonight. In fact, that will be our next event after this one. So you definitely want to stay tuned for that. Right hands, fires up, nails the Baron. He goes sailing over the top rope. And Jones helping his man out, at least helping him up to his feet. World Tag Team Championship on the line as well as the Rock and Roll Express will defend in a return bout against the Midnight Express with Jim Cornette. Von Raschke now takes Pez over to the corner. No. Pez with some elbows to the midsection. And he gets out of it. Trying to shake the cobwebs loose here. Shooting those right hands at the bald head of Baron Von Raschke. Nails him with the elbow again. And once again, Paul Jones on the apron. Jones is going to find, he's going to find himself out of here if he keeps interfering in this match. You got to think the referee will... Exercise some authority here. Watley blocks, returns fire with the right hands. No, Von Raschke reverses. What's he going to do here? Picks him up, and he... What is he doing here? He's turning him upside down here, the tree of woe. Oh, what a reversal. Pez with a knee lift. Pistol Pez Watley now goes down for the lateral press. He hooks the leg. Baron Von Raschke kicks out. Tremendous contest here on this edition of Civic Center Wrestling here on this February the 3rd. Glad to have you with me. Certainly thankful that you guys continue. Oh, there's an elbow by the pistol, man. Continue to uh, visit my channel and watch these matches as you do. Of course, you can catch all of our updates, match listings, and everything else on WWE 2K Wrestling NWA Edition on Facebook. The Baron with a gut buster. Oh, what a clubbing blow and a sleeper hold again. But this time Pez was too close to the ropes. And nice reversal by the Pistol Man. He shot Baron right off. The Baron fires back. And there's the claw. This might be it. Not very few men could ever get out of this maneuver. And I don't think Pez will either. No, it's over. Baron Von Raschke, the master of the claw hold, gets another win here in the NWA and on Civic Center Wrestling. With the claws, we take you back to the replay here. Some of the action that went down earlier on. Uh, a game effort by Pistol Pez Watley, but in the end, as you see, there was a jawbreaker. A very competitive matchup here on Civic Center Wrestling. We saw look what was looking to be a choke slam maneuver, but that was countered. Back and forth they went. The sleeper hold thought that might be it, but no, it was the claw that put down Pistol Pez Watley as Baron Von Raschke refuses to have his hand raised by the referee. But there's your winner right there. Baron Von Raschke here on Civic Center Wrestling, your winner. And we'll be back with the National Heavyweight Championship match right after this timeout. 